Hello and welcome to the world of Odium. This is season two. Yeah, I know. I'm a little late to the game. Uh, season two actually started with um, the release of version 1.13 of Minecraft, and we are currently in 1.14. Uh, I just took a break and needed a, a little bit of a break from it, but we are back and we are in Mesa because we're going to be working on the town of Sweetwater, which is a western steam town, loosely based off of the, the town of Sweetwater out of the TV show Westworld. Now, um, I am in here, uh, not not right now, but um, uh, Dariana has rejoined this world of podium. We're glad to have her back. But we also have my friend Lady Random is now a member of the world of Random. Uh, <laughs> world of random the world of odium and she's uh, also helping me out here too and hopefully you know they decide to, to work on some areas of their own as well too because they i know they've got a lot of great ideas and the things that they've got planned so let's take a look around here and yes i'm using my map because uh <laughs> i get lost too easy um so lady random has got something coming up over here it's going to require a lot of bricks and a bit of wood. And you can see up there, there's this beautiful, beautiful ranch house at the top of the mesa here that uh, Dariana's been working on. they got to show me up on everything. <laughs> so, but, yeah. And um, I can't wait to actually take a good close look at it. I'm not sure if she's finished with it yet or not. What I'm going to be building is going to be right in here. And this is just like a placeholder for it. The uh, birch building here is just a temporary trailer, you know, like thing for a uh, construction trailer. Where we've got some supplies. We've got our um, uh, nether portal. And uh, this is our list of things that we want to build in the town. So... Uh, you know, we want like an undertaker, a courthouse. I'm doing the train station. DR is me. LR is Lady Random. Uh, so a bank, a saloon, water troughs, a church, general store. Uh, over here we have uh, the ranch house, a Spanish mission, boot hill cemetery, uh, sheriff's office or jail, boarding house, livery stables, a doctor's office, roads and pathways, and gallows. Those are just some of the ideas that we've come up with. If you have any others that you would like to see us um, put in, please let us know and we'll add it to our list if, if we think it fits with our theme. And there are some uh, abandoned mine shafts over here. This is a mesa after all, so you can see them off there in the distance. So, we're going to be working on a train station. I don't know how far I'm going to get on this today. Um... But I have been gathering some resources for it. And this is approximately the area I want it to be in. So I've got a bunch of uh, spruce here. Some oak. And I've got some gravel and andesite. And some polished andesite stairs for the, the train tracks themselves. I still need a lot of other stuff. Like some cobblestone and some um, other things. Um, but let's go ahead and uh, get started with what I've got here. I'm going to go ahead and take some spruce logs and I'm going to make some planks out of them to start me out. And the base of the train station is like 21 blocks long. Um, so let me just kind of um, do it here. I'm going to knock these out and... Uh, this out this is just a, again a, a, an approximate holding spot for where this is going to be at so I'm going to move out a little bit further I'm going to start maybe here and we'll um, and we'll, we'll have to um, dig up some of the sand or lay down more or whatever so let me see so one three five Seven, nine, eleven, fifteen, fifteen, 
17, 19, and this will be 21. And I do want this to be level, so I am going to have to dig up all this sand that's uh, here. So uh, let me go ahead and do that real quick, and I'll be right back with you. All right, so I've dug back um, 12 blocks this way because there's going to be a building that's like on this side of it, part of it, and this is just the platform. We are going to have to knock this down and smooth it out, something like that. Uh, but don't worry, that's, that will come later on. Right now, it's not important. We will get that cleaned out. And it looks like we have just a ton of mobs underground here. Maybe there's a ravine or something that's underneath us. But you can see in the little mini map there, there's just tons of monsters underneath us. As long as they're underneath us and not here with us, I'm fine with that. So let me go ahead and get some of this junk out of my inventory real quick. And we're going to take a look more here. Oh, why did I throw that in there? All right, so I need some half slabs. So let's go ahead and take care of that real quick. I know I'm going to need more than that. Uh, let me just go ahead and do all that. We can always use them. Spruce slabs. All right. And I need to come back in here, look at my picture again. All right. So we are going to come in here and just kind of put these in between here like this. So we have a raised platform. It's only raised by technically a half a block. If you go from here and you look at it that way. And this is going to be, you know, of course, the platform where you stand and wait for the train or once you or you get off the train once it arrives. So fill this in. It's not be under there. our platform and then at the end of the platform here so. oh, well, I had some in my inventory already all right no big deal stairs to get me started. And put down some stairs over here. And there will also be some along the back wall here. I just got to figure out how big the uh, ticket station is going to be. Um, 
and then we need to start putting down uh, some of the guardrails along the front here so maybe let's do that real quick and that's going to be out of oak so let me go ahead some of that going some sticks building on some of that uh, swap those back where they belong One here few more and I'm going to Thing. These are going to be some lamp posts. I just got to get some lanterns. I don't have any made up yet. We probably have some iron around here though. Um, and that is that. So let me go look in our hut over here see if we got any iron I think there might be a little bit in there you can see it's just kind of a cramped quarters in here uh, oh yeah we got some iron so let me go ahead and grab a couple of these start off with four of them we're probably gonna have more in there but we'll go ahead and get those up just to make it look nice over in that corner at least mm, I think these need to go up one higher and it's night time of course all right, so let me sleep real quick. I'm going to take these up one higher and I'll and put the lanterns on them and I'll be right back with you. All right, I took them up one higher. So let's go ahead and put up some lanterns on here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. All right. That's mostly the platform done. Uh, there'll be some stairs coming down here, but again, I want to... Um, get the ticket house done real quick so I need to look at the side image here so that I can get started on this all right so we're gonna start off with down some logs here and then there's a gap of five one two three four five and then there's the other one Here, those stupid zombies <laughs> and then what is this one two three four five tall I think two three four five two three four five we can always make it bigger if we need to
hear something walking around. Is that a creeper? Okay. All right. <laughs> wow, I am panicking here because there might be a creeper underneath me. Um, let me look at this one, two, three. I think that's right. So let's just go from this one, two, three, four. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I can hear something walking around. There must be a cave or something underneath this. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. All right. And then. start on some of this here putting up the walls and we're going to inset this a bit So let me go ahead and uh, build up these walls a bit, and I'll be right back with you. All right, I've got the walls up, and I'm pretty sure this is uh, how tall I had it in there. So we need to work on a little bit of the roof. Looks like it's getting to be nighttime again real soon. Uh, so let me go ahead and get started on some of that. And I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I got the basics of the roof put up. Um, just a, a regular pointed roof like like you normally see. Um, I do want to come in here and see if we can get some of these details in here while we're at it. Since I've got the stair blocks, a few of them anyways, I need to get make a few more, need that many more, let's try about eight of them, might be enough, and yeah, we don't, I don't have any of um, uh, the new blocks yet, uh, um, scaffolding, I'm not certain where on the server we have any um, bamboo yet uh, to make some, but we'll have to get some. Uh, Dari might already have some up there. I just don't want to mess around with anything she's got going in her house there. So but right now I'm just pillaring up with all this orange sand that we got everywhere anyway. So go ahead and put that there. Yeah, that looks good. One more on the other side. Mm 
like that. There we go. Alright, I need to sleep again real quick. Didn't realize I had stairs in my offhand. Silly me. Didn't need to make any more. Alright, so I want to trim it um, in my normal Will's Night style, I guess you can say. Oh, I need um, some um, stone. So let's see if we have any over here in our construction trailer. Oh, and by the way, this is the palette that we're going to be using mostly for this area. There are some exceptions like Dari's Ranch House. We wanted it to kind of look like a, a fancy, beautiful house that the, the cattlemen would use. So, but for the town itself, mostly we're going to be doing it in these types of, of woods and blocks just for a little bit of color variation and whatnot. Let's see, do we have any stone in here? Something in there, nothing in my ender chest. Oh, you know what? We've got stone. <laughs> Forgot about that. And let's go ahead and do this while we're in it. That there. Slab on top of that. And then we got our stairs here. like that so I can get on and off of the ramp or um, platform for fairly easy there are going to be train tracks here which I'm not going to put down today but we will uh, get to that eventually so what I do need right now let me go ahead and make up a bunch of stairs we have 40 oh you know what I made the wrong thing That's all right. We might find a use for them later. We must have been mining or something. Toss this junk in here. We need a stone cutter. And I'm going to do these. Stack those. I do stack those. I wish you could put oak planks and stuff in there and do the same with wood. It's just kind of crazy that you can't. It looks like a table saw. And it'd be so nice to be able to get the same uh, yield that you do with stairs at least. Because it takes six planks to make four stairs. But if you use a stone cutter on, on stone, you get six stone will give you six stairs so it's a one-to-one -one ratio where with um, with wood you don't get that all right let me eat something real quick and then we're going to trim off this part of the building i am gonna have a, an overhang that's gonna come out here which we will probably finish up in the next episode i'm gonna do this trim real quick and then we're gonna probably end our episode here for today, if I get up here and do this, there. not there. Not like that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sand, I'm going to pillow my way up there and do this real quick. Get the right 
angle to that. Do that without falling off the building. Let's try this again. Without falling off the building. Throwing everything everywhere. this up there as well. Like that. Okay, let me do the other side. There's the side here, and I was going to go ahead and do this too real quick. Not there. At least get the back of the building done. There's a zombie pigman in our trailer. Well, at least the back of the building is done. We've got the platform in, and this is going to be our ticketing booth. I need to get a couple of things to finish this up. Um, I just put the slabs in here for the flooring. I've got to put up a door. This is where the conductor will come in, and of course the ticketing agent. And then we're going to have the roof extend out here over at least this portion of it and then we're going to do some decorating on the um, the platform itself and then we'll start on the rails as well so between episodes what i need to do is i need to kind of knock back some of this and make the terrain look a little bit better um again this building isn't going to be here forever it's just a temporary spot for us to have a sanctuary for the night away from the monsters 
And we'll see how many randoms doing on her building over here. And I think Dari's might be near finished with hers. I'll find out from her, and if and she is, I'll show you that next week. If she's done with it, that is. All right, well, that's it for this episode. The next episode, we're going to finish up our train station here. We'll probably start working on some of the tracks, at least the ones that stop here in front of the train station. Um, they're probably going to eventually go up over the hill or into the side of the mountain there into a tunnel uh, that leads off to whoever knows. Who, who knows? We're not going to be building that far out anyways. So until next time, this is Desert Rat. Have a good one. Goodbye.